hi guys welcome to a new video so today's video is going to be a curly hair essentials video and um, you know i have been really busy these days uh, there has been some work going on around my house and i wanted to do this video there are many other videos ideas that i almost have that i want to put forth before you but for now it's going to be a curly hair essential video it's been like a long time since i've done a curly hair video and i think last time i said i'm going to violate the cg friendly method and it didn't go well so the whole idea of applying silicones to your hair is kind of damaging so before we get into the whole detail of this video don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so yeah about the silicones i did use a silicone based serum and a silicone based styling cream i started shedding a lot of hair because um, i began with my you know usual virgin hair i had i was using for quite some time clean products with no silicone no parabens no sulfates no harsh chemicals so i'm going back to that i'm not going to use and even her, uh, my hair is chemically tre uh, treated as in I have colored my hair and herbal essence was working just fine. It does have sulfates and that also is making my hair shed a lot. Although it says it is color protectant formula is what is there in that uh, herbal essence line of argan oil of Morocco. It doesn't work that well when your hair is chem chemically treated or you have like uh, color done to your hair you have done professional hair coloring it is always recommended that you use like a mild shampoo color uh, what you say color protected then uh, words like silicone free sulfate free paraben free color free fragrance free those are like clean products and that is what you should use today's video is about the essentials that you need so i have two spray bottles if you are a curly head girl you know why you need spray bottles and these are fine mist spray bottles i was using this for quite some time and i saw this uh, curly head youtuber i think her name is it's remy uh, is her this and she has luscious long curls and uh, she was making a video where she puts aloe vera juice in her spray bottle she prepares aloe vera juice oh no she uses store-bought aloe vera juice to put it in her mist bottle spray so she hydrates her curls by spraying it. now that is what i did with this bottle this bottle sprays like this i'm just going to spray and show it to you if you keep pressing this uh, uh the thing that dispenses the spray the button that dispenses the spray it sprays continuously and it's amazing with this bottle you have to use distilled or filtered water if you use something else in it it's going to clog your this is what it looks like on the inside it is going to clog the whole mechanism and it's kind of hard to even fix it it's nearly impossible to fix the bottle so i had a black small bottle like this one i had to throw that out because it was impossible to uh, fix it and it wasn't spraying at all so i got this from amazon it's a fine spray mist bottle this i use only to use only to fill in filtered or distilled water so what i do is like this 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 is all my dry hair if you can see so i wash my hair like twice a week i don't wash regularly and whenever i feel my hair is dirty and it needs cleaning then i will wash so i spray with this bottle and this bottle today i ordered, i received this yesterday from amazon and in this i did aloe vera juice and water i'm going to tell you how i did it you can watch the next clip this is what i did
okay you see the clip i have put water i have put aloe vera juice i have sieved the aloe vera juice so that it is in the clearest and liquidest liquidest is a word it's you know the flow of the water is clean the liquid is clean and in its purest form so that i don't clog the mist bottle and i'm not using this mist bottle i'm using this one take a look at the tip i think most thermal uh, protectant spray bottles are this way so what i do is once i have sprayed my hair with this i'm going to spray the aloe vera juice you can add a few drops of you know lavender oil or peppermint oil something to give that extra you know scent to your uh, diy wide hair spray this spray this diy hair spray is very hydrating to your hair if you don't know the whole benefit of uh, aloe vera juice and i would recommend you use your aloe vera juice like i said in its filtered and clearest form there should be no particles remaining no clumps remaining in your aloe vera juice so that you don't you know ruin your spray bottle this is even hydrating to the scalp so i have dandruff i have den uh, my scalp is flaky it has got dandruff and i was having a slight pain on my crown area i think it is because of the dandruff infection and when i sprayed my crown area with this i don't know the pain just went off that's how powerful and healing of a uh what do you say element this uh, aloe vera juice or spray that i have prepared has so i think a year ago i prepared a video where i said how i refresh my curls and i had mentioned about the denman brush now i'll tell you for what i use the denman brush when i color my hair and i want the color to be evenly distributed to my hair i comb my hair with the denman brush i don't use this as a styling tool because i hate the fact that my curls shrink and they become way tighter than i want them to be i like my hair like this i use a white tooth comb it doesn't make it as you know there's no shrinkage my curls are as loose as possible okay and even combing my hair becomes so easy that's how good the aloe vera juice is and yesterday i did before going to bed i did spray my hair with the aloe vera juice and i used my uh, as usual himalaya himalaya protein hair cream as a styling cream and you know this is the final look of my hair I really like this and always when you prepare your aloe vera juice at home make sure that you sieve it properly every the liquid should be in its clearest form don't leave any aloe vera particle in it aloe vera gel particle or aloe vera piece in it otherwise it's going to clog your spray bottle this you can get easily on amazon i'm going to link the links of these spray bottles in the description box below if you like this video if you think this was helpful you know hit the like button and you can share your curly hair routine if you all have and how you all refresh your curls what you all do to make those curls look luscious you can comment below i don't know i don't have extreme knowledge i like any other curly head girl i do have a love and hate relationship with my hair so you know i'm i hate straight hair because straight hair doesn't fit the frame of my face my face as you know is plump and chubby so this is the right kind of hair for me god given right kind of hair okay so that's all for this video i hope to see you in my next video until then bye